Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. My name is Spooky Sim Street and I'm so excited to be bringing you a creative sim for today's video. Today's video is definitely a shorter one and that is just because I've had a really, really busy week and I really wish it could be longer, but I actually make sims pretty fast and then when I like speed them up, it just, it goes so fast. So... I don't know. I, I'm sorry about that, but I will tell you that this creative sim is really cute and I really hope you like her. She will be up for download. Um, I am thinking about putting this sim up onto my Patreon for early access. Uh, the link for my Patreon will be in the description, so definitely check that out. She will either be for free or for early access on one of my tiers. I haven't completely decided that yet because it is not, like, the release date. So, um, yeah, I I don't know. I just kind of wanted to try out the whole Patreon thing, Um and yeah, I, I get really attached to my sims, so I really wanted to like make a whole story for her, which is fine, but whenever I get attached, I want to make like a whole, I don't know, like challenge or legacy out of my sims. That's why I don't do creative sims like that often, because I just don't have the time to have like five challenges at once, <laughs> so yeah, I really love this sim. I want to incorporate her into one of the challenges I have going on my channel right now. Maybe she can be like a best friend or something of one of my main characters because I love this sim. I've been loving the Dark Academia aesthetic recently. I don't know if it's because I'm in college and it's like winter and I don't really know what's going on, but I love the aesthetic. <laughs> and i just i really like how the sim turned out um i created her really quickly so i'm so sorry that this video is short at least shorter than my usual videos but i really like that how she turned out and i hope you guys do too and hopefully um everything will go great with the download i've never put a sim up for download um as far as me being on like out in the public and on youtube so I'm hoping everything goes well. Definitely let me know if anything doesn't in the comments and I will fix it as soon as I possibly can. But yeah, um, also let me know what you think about Creative Sims and like if you think she should be in one of my Let's Plays like Eden's Life or even in my Family Dynamics Challenge. I can make her like a friend or a sibling or something. I don't know. I just want to incorporate her somehow because she is so gorgeous and I love her so much. I love all of her outfits. I did two everyday outfits and then the rest of her outfits as well. So she doesn't have that many because usually when I'm like playing with a sim like full on like a challenge or something, I will give them like multiple outfits for each category and it's it's too much. I'm so extra, I know, but... I just, I feel like that's more realistic, honestly, at least, like, for the most part, because usually, like, every time you want to go to sleep, you don't wear the same outfit, you know what I mean? I don't know. <laughs> I just love playing realistically, so, yeah. She has a cute little band-aid on her nose, and I don't really know the story behind that, so you can make one up if you'd like. But I just thought it was so cute and I just had to put it there. I don't really know that that's like going with the dark academia aesthetic, but you know, it's cute, like I said. So she also has like bitten lips and I thought that little touch was cute because I also bite my lips a lot and I don't know, I think it has something to do with like social anxiety. I noticed that's when I do it is when I'm getting like nervous like meeting new people or something so i don't know maybe she's the same way also her tattoos are so pretty i don't have any tattoos in real life but i would like to get some in the future my cat just jumped onto my lap by the way i hope you can't hear her like i hope she's not distracting <laughs> even though she's so cute she is so distracting sometimes but yeah i think 
that's basically all I wanted to say for this video. I really hope you guys like her. As always, you can let me know any ideas you have for future videos. Oh my gosh, my cat is being so crazy. <laughs> um, yeah, definitely let me know any ideas, especially for Creative Sims, because I love making them. So yeah, I will see you guys next time. Thank you so much for watching. Bye! Thank you.